Hey guys, Faith here. Oh, oh, okay, it's already starting. Oh, I'm lagging so bad. <laughs> yeah, um, uh oh. Ooh, lagging so bad. <laughs> Come on, recover. Jeez. Okay, so I downloaded this mod, um, the invasion mod, uh, the tower defense mod, you can find on the forums. Yeah, apparently I got to what blade right now? Yeah, that's why it got kind of crazy. Level four, <laughs> 47. Um, I decided to record, see if I could um, get up to 50 for this um, little tip, little bit here. Um, remember that last video that I had where it was um, that double... <laughs> yeah, ignore this for now. Yeah, remember that last video where it, I created those two lava towers? Well, basically, I, again, I took it one step further. Um, I created like a stronghold. Oh, it's... Done. 47. Okay. Yeah, I kind of took the idea one step further and created a room um, where the walls consisted of full-on Archangel Smites on pedestals. Uh, <laughs> and right behind them, uh, right behind, uh, right in front of these pedestals are is basically a wall of lava. So it's pretty much like a. Um, if I could describe this. It's basically a fire. It's like a I don't know what to describe it actually. Fire fire arrow stronghold of some sort. But the only way I could describe it is you know the just I'm just gonna show you the action basically. So okay, I can't I can't ignore that. Uh, let's get all the stuff. Get all the stuff. Get all the stuff. And the green is starting to blind me. The experience is starting to blind me. <laughs> This mod is amazing. This equivalent exchange, um, I think that was the two big mods that I'm going to feature for this video here. So yeah, I'm going to see how far I could take it to level 50, and let me see if I could assess the damage and repair since I think this way is more or less done. Let's see. Yeah, the big pain about this... Oh. The big pain about this build, or this setup, is it's ridiculously hard to repair. Say that, remember how... Ooh, ooh. It's starting. <laughs> it's starting. Okay, let's see what it... <laughs> so yeah, my, see it, my setup basically is the, the main stronghold here, with four little mini towers just to like slow down the mod. Oh god, I hate that guy. That guy is the reason why Ooh, I go through so much pain. He basically throws boulders and destroys my uh, my structure here. But pretty much without him, I'm pretty much safe, actually. Even though these are... there's... <laughs> there's just a parade of mobs trying to go after the Nexus. Oh, and I'm lagging so bad. Okay. Here they come. So even, oh, yeah, even if they get through the arrows, and you, you know, there's a little lag between, uh, you know, the waves of arrows. I, imp oh, ow. I implemented a, um, a moat down below, and down below are black hole bands. So basically, they'll get sucked down there, and they won't be able to get in anymore. Um, and yeah, I think I'm safe with that two-layer defense. This build is more like total offense than defense, because it, it just mows down mobs like crazy. But when it comes to when it comes to repair, um, it's it's a pain. Like I have to stand in front of the pedestals to repair. I really don't like standing in front of active, you know. Archangels, my pedestals that could just shoot me full of arrows. Uh, yeah, so let's see how far I could get with this video. Yeah, I implemented this ceiling here, or this roof, just to combat that stupid boulder thr throwing ogre. It's three layers full of obsidian and one layer of, um, what was it? 
red wool so that if I see it's basically use um, I use the red wool just as a a visual to see how if you know if the ceiling is coming down but you know after 47 waves later apparently that's not the case so I think I'll be safe so yeah let's watch them all die <laughs> this is so cool oh man I'm just gonna get the experience now and yeah, this is just pretty much an experience um, <laughs> setup. like I don't have to even well I just have, I just have to repair like the the pedestals they got knocked down but other than that it's just you know stand back watch wait for wave to be done and collect experience I mean look at <laughs> look at level 90 right now I've never seen my experience you know go up this high before I mean at least this fast on my main world I'm pretty much higher but yeah I mean at this rate you know 40, <laughs> 48 waves later um yeah I started from I started at level 1 starting this single game here right level 90 40 something waves later I, again I can't ignore that Oh man, what's wrong? Oh my! Ooh, that! Ooh, lag! Lag! <laughs> oh, I wish I could have caught that. Oh, oh well. Man, that was so laggy. Wow, what happened there? Yeah, I kind of altered the config to this. I'm allowing the game to hold three times the normal amount of mobs spawned. I think it was like 140 or something. So that would explain the large number of mobs spawning at once. Jeez, now I really can't see. <laughs> My experience now. Oh man, this is insane. The colors. The colors. <laughs> Jeez, it just never ends. This is so much. Hey, 48! We passed 48! Like, I could do stuff. I mean, I could... <laughs> I could kill zombies as well, but, you know, I wanted to automate this thing. I just wanted to sit back, relax, and just gather all the stuff, see? Yeah, I altered that so I, you normally won't see mobs like that spawn in a group like that. At least that number. But for the purposes... For, for this, you know, tower defense run, I really wanted to, like, do a stress test on how bad um, this uh, structure can defend off the waves and waves of mobs. So, and even with a good computer, I'm lagging like nuts when it comes to like. Oh, oh! Don't stand in front. Don't stand in front. Yeah, the lesson I learned from the previous couple of previous videos: don't ever, <laughs> don't have. Your don't ever have your back turned against your um, your defense system. They could shoot you in the back, and that would suck hard. Oh yeah, I have this thing too, the life stone. Qu again, equivalent exchange. Um, I have a constantly on, so I'm pretty much not going to die. <laughs> I just wanted to see if I could survive... Um, if I, if I could prevent the mobs from ever getting into the nexus, which has definitely been the case. I mean, they've never gotten even into that wall of lava. It's always the fire arrows that have been like, holding them back, so... Yeah, and I got those four towers to slow down the... Shoot, I hate that guy. Oh no! Speed up his death. Yeah, the thing you have to be careful with um, <laughs> with a build like this, the mass amount of uh, fire arrows. If they have nothing to... T damn it. Oh, I'll take the hit. I'd rather take the hit than to have repaired my structure. Hate these guys, hate these guys. There you go. Die, die. And they're like, yeah, they're like bees, basically. I, I really want to call this structure like the beehive, the lava beehive. Because... You know, the arrows that fly out, the number of arrows that fly out, it's like a 
swarm of bees just like attacking everything. I mean, look at that. Look, look at that. <laughs> it's basically if fire was a living thing and was angry at the world, this is how fire would treat us. Let's just go after you and just, just you know, decimate, decimate everything in sight. Okay, I'm gonna see if I can even hit level 100 in this video. That, well, let's, let's try that. Either 50, either either finish wave 50 or hit level 100. Hopefully I could hit level 100. <laughs> that would be pretty awesome. Oh, the carnage, the carnage. Uh, pig engineer. Spider, pig engineer. Alright, everything's good so far. Everything's good. Eh? Oh, oh. <laughs> Oh. Dude! Yeah, you see, you gotta be careful of that. Um, luckily I have that OP armor from Quibble Exchange, that full set. So I'm pretty much not gonna... I'm pretty much not gonna die. I just wanna see if we can get to this little nexus here. And yeah, sometimes I forget to put on my armor when I go to sleep, so I have this sign to remind me to um, put on my armor when I get out there. Let's see. Oh yeah, that's right. I can make more diamonds. Basically, there's this thing called Rift Flux. Let me show you the recipe. Um, I mean, the, the uses for this. You can power up your sword, uh, create more stuff, or um, the invasion mod. Um, I forgot what this does. It's strange. Oh, I think this um, ties your wolves to the nexus. So that even if they die trying to attack the mobs, they're just gonna respawn near the nexus. But I don't need that. Um, I have my structure doing that for me. <laughs> um, actually, the thing that I really want to show you was make diamonds with reflux and uh, and iron ingots, redstone, uh, lapis. And make some traps with it as well. But I'm just mostly making diamonds with the with the reflux I'm making. Oh man, we missed so much. <laughs> yeah, I don't have to do anything. I'm just gonna let the beehive do all the work for me, and I could just—I mean, I could just go back in and sleep if I even wanted to. Oh, here we go. Oh, wow. Oh, I'm gonna lag so bad. Here it comes. Here they come. Shh. I think I'm gonna crash at this rate. I don't know if I'm gonna. Is crazy. I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna crash before I can get to level to wave 50. Man, that is nuts. The colors. The colors. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> 97. Jeez, it's still going. It's still going. I think it's almost done. Almost done. There we go. And there's still 49. <laughs> it's almost done. Alright, okay, there we go. The big one, 50. I honestly I wanted to get to a hundred. I was gonna wait, but it's been It's been a couple hours already since I started this. Uh, since I started the Nexus. So I think I'm just gonna go up to fifty and <laughs> and uh, stop it there. Yep, lava beehive. Love this. Love this thing. Oh, I gotta see if I can need to repair anything. Oh, wave's done. Damn, I have to report, repair that one. That one's. Oh no. Oh, I think I can do something here. Let's see if I could. I could jump into the lava. There's an item in the equivalent exchange that allows me to be. I mean, allows me to jump into lava, be immune to it. Now, I could, I think, attach a pedestal. No. 
Ooh, that's bad. So I just learned something just now. I can't really... I don't really have a fix for diagonal um, pedestals. Hmm. That's... That's a bummer. Okay. Well, anyway. Let's just get through level 50 and uh, <laughs> get this over with. Man, I didn't expect this uh, mod to lag me so bad. Well, considering I upped the, the mob rate to like three times the normal rate, I'm not surprised. Alright, here we go. Play 50. Here they come. There you go. Just get into it. Slow down the mob. Slow down the mobs as much as you can. I don't have to do anything. I mean, I could, but I'm gonna like, I'm gonna let this defense system do all the work. Except with this guy here. With this guy, I want to prevent um, him destroying my structure. He's my only real threat. That fat ogre guy. Everyone else can't get to this structure. They can't even get into the lava wall. It's always the arrows that stop them, as you saw. A while back. Shoot, they're stepping it up now. That stupid ogre. There you go. There you go, there you go. Good. Good. And they're stepping it up. Man. Yeah, full armor allows me to fly. I think either I'm not sure if it's just the boots or if I need the full set. I may need the full set, but I have this ring of Arcana anyway, so it's like it's double redundant in terms of flying ability. So either you have the ring of Arcana here or the full set. No, well, that will allow you to fly. Let's get the loot, 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 loot. Come on, 100. This sucks. I do not want to be blinded though. <laughs> While like waves and waves of mobs are coming out. I mean, sure, I'm, in I'm invincible, but still kind of gets me kind of <laughs> jumpy. All this. Oh, I just might. Ooh, I just might get to 100. If you guys are familiar with the equivalent extremes, um, I'm basically never gonna run out of space with the setup I have here. It's basically an alchemy, this alchemy bag here. It's like a portable chest, and inside of it, I put one of these power items that uh, activate um, the void ring. It's, it sucks in items and converts them to like the highest, uh, the highest uh, EMC ring. I just got distracted by that full wave of arrows there. It must, must have been that one there. Yeah, you gotta be careful when they bundle up over and just shoot out. Oh, here we come. Here they come. Shoot, that's huge. That is huge. Creepers and Creepers potentially could be your biggest threat when it comes to this setup. If you're close to when they get sucked in the lava, like that lava wall, if you're close to that wall, you know, while they're dying, they still can explode, and they can leave a big, gigantic wall in your defense. Practically irreparable unless you somehow find a miracle of a way to not die while repairing. But, um, as long as they don't explode, as long as um, you kill the ogres, this is a pretty invincible setup, in my opinion. I'm sure there's better ones. I'm sure there's Smaller, more efficient ones out there, but um, what is that there? Oh, fire. Um, but yeah, this is my approach to it. So, man, th this wave's not done yet. Thought this wave would be done already. Let's get the experience. Oh, I hit a hundred! Oh, right. <laughs> I didn't notice that till now. Nice. All right. So good. I finished wave fifty. I hit level one hundred. And yeah, once this wave is finished, um, it's a good way to end this video. Let's see what else is oh, shoot. Oh, the lag! Lagging! Yep. 
Even the hordes of zombies can't be. <laughs> they can't stop this. They can't. Not just in numbers. They need like the ogres and the creepers to explode. They need all the right conditions. But for me, they're just a wave of experience. I mean, look, look at this. Look at the colors. Oh, my 101. Oh man. Yeah, I should. I really shouldn't be standing here, but pretty when <laughs> all that experience is gathering around you, swarming around. I think that will do it here. I think that's it. Yeah, I didn't want to do, I didn't want to record building this because this was just a total headache trying to set this up. 50 is done. Oh man, did they break through this? Man, finally they're breaking through it after 50 waves later. Jeez, okay. So yeah guys, um, fade again here, um, uh, thanks for watching, <laughs> yeah, again, pretty, this is just overdoing it, basically, but the result, I mean, just again, the result of it, <laughs> it's just too amusing. Alright guys, thanks a lot for watching, um, see you next time, alright, okay guys, um, thanks.